video, I'm going to show you how to use ChatGPT with Power Pivot to build incredible KPIs that calculate themselves and, and apply to your entire file. Check this out. Let's go ahead and do a KPI. So if I come back to ChatGPT, let's put in our KPI prompt. So we're going to say, now help me turn profitability percent into a KPI in Power Pivot. My target profitability is going to be 20% by default and explain how to set up the thresholds. Let's go ahead and add this in and see what we get back. You'll notice when I ask simpler, more straightforward questions, especially around the coding, it's coming back a lot faster than when I'm asking it to do kind of evaluation on the entire model. All right, so I've already got the measure set up, so I can just go to create KPI. Let's do that. We'll go new KPI. So this KPI is going to be based on my profit percent. I need to define the target value. Let's see if it gave us that option. So our target value is going to be absolute, and we want to do it as 0.2, meaning we want to flag if our profitability is above... We want to flag if our profitability is above or below 20%. And then is there anything else chat would like us to do? Three states, red less than 10, yellow 10 to 20, and green above 20. So we can go back and set that up just as it has suggested. So let's take this up to 0.1. This is at 0.2, so we are all set. If it's above 20, it's good. Down to 10, it's going to be yellow. And below that, it'll be red. So we'll hit that in there. Okay, so now we can check if our KPI is working. So I can check to see what my actual profit percentage is so all of this is high so it looks like in theory everything will come back as a green we can go and check our goal goal for everything is 20 percent as it should be but let's see the status so in this case everything was profitable i probably should have tossed some unprofitable ones in there but proof of concept everything is green and our kpi is functional so we've just used chat gpt to do all of our DAX code that we can just copy and paste in. It understands our model, it can manage our model, and now we are all set.